Well, it wasn't quite that easy for Marquette on Monday night at Valley Fields, but it was pretty close as the Golden Eagles thrashed Northwestern 4-1. to one. Everyone's doing their little their piece, and whether it's it looks like it's big or whether it's small, uh, I think we're we're dangerous. I think because of the speed and our ability to get behind, and the subtleties that people like Luca Purple are bringing and Connor Alba, it's really helping us. The scoring started early as Toby Howell put home this one-on-one -on -one header off an assist from Martin Alba to make it one nothing Golden Eagles. Marquette doubled its lead in the 49th minute on this Diego Nunez goal, his first of the year. Golden Eagles led 2-0 after that volley. Northwestern had a chance to get back in the game in the 73rd minute when Marquette goalkeeper Mac Wheeler was shown a red card for this hit in the box. Jeffrey Hobson took advantage of the opportunity for Northwestern and converted this PK to put the Cats down only 2-1. I mean, with this team, we never feel like we're ever outmatched or under under a situation we can't get out of. So again, we were we went down to 10, but we were really calm and we knew that we had to stay strong defensively and the two goals were, were a bonus of that. <laughs> Even while down to 10 men, Marquette still found a way to break through with this Ben Tweedy shot. And the match wouldn't have been complete without another goal from Luca Perpa, his fifth of the year to put Marquette ahead 4-1, where they would stay for good. It, has, it is confidence building, and it's a lot easier to critique and to criticize people on a 4-1 win than a 4-1 loss. The Golden Eagles have some well-deserved time off after their three-match winning streak. They head to St. Louis to take on the Billikens on Friday. Reporting from Valley Fields, Andrew Goldstein, MUTV Sports.